my channel yeah today I'm going to wear a mask like in the COVID epoch like I used to do some time ago because now I'm suffering from really hard uh, teeth issues I didn't want you to see me like this but today is the second anniversary of the Volgograd 10 run and it's our favorite run one of our favorite runs here and I want to take you with us let's go so today I'm going to show you uh, everything around me much more than myself because I've already told you that I lack teeth and <laughs> I do not look well and I won't look well for some more time I'm sure and now you can see Sanya and Grisha we are under uh, near the Volg River is there we are near the stadium the Volga Arena you can see it there my children used to train here during the Covid epoch and now we are going to celebrate the second anniversary of the Volga 10 run and it's going to be fantastic because it's going to be a night run because the athletes were scared of the warmth of the heat but it turned out that it's not hot and it is raining now it is raining you can see the bridge it is very beautiful it is raining i'm sorry for my accent today it is even more weird because it is hard to speak when you do not have all the teeth you need <laughs> so i'm going to pronounce the words in a weird way i'm sorry for this i took off his jacket because it turned out that it is warm here and i was scared that it would be really cool here but it turned out that it is warm and this summer it is extremely weird it is not hot as always here in Volgograd and it is constantly raining just like now so we are surprised we are here today with Sanya and with Grigori because our dad accidentally got ill this morning he he had high temperature and he still has high temperature and when we were getting prepared for this run suddenly it started to rain and the rain was really heavy and we got scared that is why we decided not to take Nina with us because we took some things to cover us and to cover the stroller to get rid of this rain but anyway we decided not to take her with us oh. There are some guys on scooters and I already see the runners there. I'm going to show you some, some interesting things and we're going to go to the runners because oh my god I can see the lightning and I can hear the thunder. It is dark, it's going to be dark today but still I want to show everything to you because uh, you know that now there is the World Championship, Athletic Championship in the United States of America and there are no Russian athletes but I want to show you the atmosphere and to speak about it are we disappointed, are we sad, are we mm, desperate or something like this and I just want to take you with us to show you something interesting because you know that my blog was about our life here, our happy life and everything interesting around us, not about our suffering not about surviving under sanctions or something like this some guys are going to run naked under the rain <laughs> it's very interesting and you can see that nowadays the stadium looks like the flag of Russia do you see this the flag of Russia it's very beautiful and now it's going to show us the letter Z you can see it it is there and there and we're already approaching the place of the start and I can already see the runners there are the runners under their umbrella this is Sunny he's going to try on his new um, how is this thing called? Not a t-shirt, but something like this. A shirt, t-shirt. These are some efforts. Changing clothes. 
some other pathways, some wet pathways. And this is the statue of a bird on the way. Very beautiful. Ну, вообще отлично. Так Ну да. Повернись спиной. Видишь? Ран Волгоград написано. Я не знаю, чем, где. А, ну да, наверное, перед это ночь, а сзади это. Ну да. Волгоградская десятка. Григорий. Григориус. Нет, не подкупишь меня, малютка. She's our famous athletic star, local star. And I also saw some men wearing yellow blue clothes. It was written that it's forbidden to swim here. It says Kamaskwa. <laughs> Some football fans to Iska Moskva from Moscow left their stickers on the sign. <coughs> Grisha is laughing. He's not going to sleep. Even though I'm already tired of him. And it's it is not typical of him not to sleep when it's so late already. The run is going to start at 22 p.m. Sign is still warming up. Under the flag of Russia, you can see that it's going to transform into the flag of Russia. It's very beautiful. And I'm already waiting for the beginning of the run. Everyone is already ready to start. The final preparations are taking place now. Lab has started. Grigorsha is watching other children. And we are going just to walk now from the place of the start, from the mountain to the end of this embankment. We're just going to walk and I'm going to make Grigori fall asleep. I hope so at least. And we are going to watch Sunny and other runners. I hope that this young man is going to slip and that I'm going to watch the competition without him <laughs> because it's high time for him to sleep. He's already tired and I'm also tired of him, <laughs> I should say. I want to be sincere with you and I hope that you can understand me because every time when I talk to you not showing you myself, I do it without my mask. I, I can already see the first runners, the first participants. Wow, they are super fast. Well, let's have a look at them. And our beautiful girl in Ukraine socks and her suit is also of the same colors. There is a man after her in the same. He's in the same set of colors. Grigori, do you see Sanya? Молодец, Санёк, беги, беги, отлично. Удачи тебе, беги, Санёк. Санёк. The main thing that I want to tell you today is that I love this vlog. 
and I love such videos and my channel was actually created for such videos and I'm very sad that nowadays they get not so much attention not like the videos about sanctions, surviving under sanctions, different problems here and so on my channel was created not for this it was created for such vlogs vlogs of happy people doing what they really love, what they want and I wanted to show this beautiful life that we have to the whole world and actually I feel very very sorry that now I can't do this and I understand that it's not the main problem in the world nowadays but still this makes me feel that part of my life was stolen and this makes me really disappointed and sad And that was all for today, my dear friends. We are still partying here and we are going to party here for some time. And I'm sure that we are going to return home at 1 a.m. or even later. But it is great. I love this run very much. I love such events. And I love to spend my time with my children like this. Thank you very much for watching. See you in another vlog.